the Canadian Michelin Guide has been revealed, with 13 Toronto restaurants receiving the coveted Michelin star. 2022 selection of the Michelin Guide in Toronto with one star to... Amuri Hana. The famous one, two, or three Michelin stars single out restaurants deemed to have exceptional cuisine that reflects the personality of the chef. 12 Toronto restaurants, including Yorkville's Aburi Hana, received one star. How does it feel to be the very first Toronto restaurant yes. to receive a Michelin yeah, star? I know. Uh, I come in all the way from Japan to the stage here is a very finally. Very, today is a very, very happy and very emotional. Anonymous Michelin inspectors from 15 countries dined at more than 70 Toronto restaurants before narrowing their list. There were no three stars and inevitably only one restaurant in Toronto was deemed worthy of a two star rating. Sushi Masaki Saito. What should I say? Something. So I want to tell that just two. One is a, uh, I love Toronto, I love Canada. Thank you. One more thing is, uh, I'm still single. I don't know why. <laughs> Canada's first Michelin guide being in Toronto is expected to provide a big economical boost for the city. We know how strong the culinary scene is. We know the depth and the breadth of it here as residents. Now the world is going to know. Michelin has a global audience of, of food enthusiasts, people that travel for outstanding culinary experiences. This is going to help them know about what's here in Toronto. <laughs> I think it's really exciting to have more opportunity, more world-class fare. I uh, kind of feel like a little bit of Europe has come here as well, so really excited to see all the exciting options that we have now. Named after the tire company, the Michelin Guide was first published in France in 1900 to encourage tire sales by offering advice to travelers. Today, it's one of the most coveted distinctions in the world for restaurants. You can see the full list of the city's new Michelin star restaurants at toronto.citynews.ca. At Evergreen Brickworks, Michelle Mackey, City News.